Let me see. Hey guys. That was my phone. Okay, that's cool. Of course, I have to have my coffee. It's my first coffee of 2021. Today is January 1st. Starting off the year with a large McDonald's coffee because that's how we do it. So, today's video is going to be a huge clothing haul over the past couple of months. I have Shein, I have Misguided, I have Walmart, I have Adidas, I have Urban Outfitters, American Eagle. So many places to be included in this video. I'm not sure if I'm making it a try on or not. Probably not because that's literally so much work. But we will see about it. I am literally sitting on my bed just piles of clothes beside me so let's get right into this video i definitely did not just clean off that little side table in the back because the clutter was giving me anxiety definitely did not do that no not at all couldn't be me okay i'm gonna start with misguided i cannot remember how i discovered this website but during quarantine sis was on there all the freaking time like an unhealthy amount literally Love Misguided. They're always having sales going on. Their products are such high quality. And I literally cannot say enough. Go check out Misguided. They literally have everything. I'm obsessed. Might be my new favorite store. Okay, so the first thing that I got from Misguided is this, like, really cute workout set. So I got leggings. And they're, like, the kind that's supposed to make, like, your butt and your legs look good. Like, they have, like, body sculpting. I don't even know. But it does make the booty look good. And they're super comfortable. I kind of wish I got a different size though. I got a small and they're kind of like too small. I got the matching sports bra to go with it. You really like high quality material and I've always wanted to try this kind of like legging because they're super trendy right now and it's really cute to have like a little like matching set. The next thing I got is this pair of mom jeans which was only $20 and they are my favorite jeans I've ever gotten. If for reference mine are a size 6 so it says it's a high rise mom jean. And it's like this light wash and it's like riot so on like the ends of it it's like a little bit distressed and also like around the top it's a little bit distressed these pants just fit so well on me like it's like tight around the waist but then looser towards the feet obviously that's what like a mom jean is supposed to be it's just so like flattering and they're just really cute and like high quality and i love them and then these ones i got more recently this is another pair of high-rise mom jeans but they are black and they have distressing on the knee which I think is super cute and then this last pair is what do they even call this they're like jogger jeans which I also was oh okay high-waisted jogger mom jeans so then this is like the color of them and on the ends, it's like tapered. Is that what you call it? So yeah, literally just jogger jeans, which I have nothing like that. So I'm really excited to add this to my wardrobe and try out some new things and some new outfits with those. Anyways, then I got this pair of Playboy sweatpants, which my parents kind of had a fit about, but I just didn't think it was that big of a deal because they're like trendy. But they're like this purple color, which I got another pair of joggers that were plain and they were this like purple color, but I can't find them right now. And it says Playboy in, like, yellow. It was, like, the Playboy X Mixguided um, collab. And they have, like, the tapered bottoms. Just, like, a pair of joggers. So, so comfortable and soft. And I literally love them a lot. Here's a little shirt that I got. It's a little crop top. I'm pretty sure it was, like, $5, so I was like, why not? I guess I will do Shein next because... This summer is when I really like discovered Shein and I've always been like afraid to like shop on the website and stuff and you like watch videos and get like mixed reviews on things and what I find my top tip with Shein is to make sure you look at picture reviews and make sure you get a product that has like it like will tell you like five stars and like 10,000 reviews it says like 9999 plus by the reviews and then you know that it's actually a good product and a lot of people have reviewed it don't get something sketchy that has like a hundred reviews on it. Reviews are key, look at picture reviews, and then you'll be set. So just like the popular items on there, that's what I did and I had no issues with it. So I got a whole bunch of crop tops this summer. All like 4 or $5 each, which is really good. And the material is not amazing, but it's good enough that it's not causing an issue. So I got this one and it's like the square neck cut thing that's like trendy right now and it's like a mustard color. And then I got that same one, 
but it's in like this light green and then I actually got four of these but I only have three with me right now and it's like a velvet crop top and I really like the neckline it's that like straight across neckline again and I just thought that the velvet was so cute and you could really dress this up or dress it down so I have this purple color I have this red one and I have this like lighter purple and then I have like a dark green one but I can't find it right now and this has more of like an athletic kind of material but it's like a v-neck racer back kind of top so I have like a red color and then I also have like a black one that's not with me right now I got this like checkered print like crop top and it's like a super soft material and it has like double straps to like add a little bit of like character to it I guess also got these like little like comfy shorts and I don't like hate them but I'm not like a huge fan and I wouldn't wear them anywhere besides like the house because they're like thin and like short but just for like comfy shorts around the house I guess they're like fine but I think they were like eight bucks so not worth that price but they were supposed to be like the dolphin shorts and I just got like an all black pair last item from Shein is this shirt ball which I actually really really like so it's this like teddy bear material and shirt bows are pretty pricey and I think this one was around like $10 so I thought that that was like a really good deal. And it's hooded, it has like a pocket in the front which I really like and it had a little bit of shedding at first and I think it still does but nothing unbearable and it's like really soft and comfortable so I honestly really really like this and I do recommend it. So that is everything from Shein. Overall had a good experience just make sure you look at the reviews to make sure everything is good to go with that. Okay, next we will do Urban Outfitters, and I only got one thing from there. Actually, I got two things. I got this Wildflower phone case. It's super cute. It's like a limited edition, like, little floral, pinky print going on. Kind of looks like a bandana. It's super cute, and I love it. So I got that, and I got this dress on sale for, like, $20, and it is so freaking cute. I was really nervous about getting it without trying it on because I'm really tall. I'm 5'9". So dresses fit me like really weird, but this one is super soft and adorable. So this is what it looks like. It's going to be so, so, so cute for this summer. I'm really excited. It has a v-neck, a little like cut off here and like some ruffles and like more ruffles down at the bottom. I took a video in this whenever I got it. So I will insert that so you guys can see what it looks like, but I literally love this dress and I'm super excited to wear it this summer. Got one thing at American Eagle and it's this blue Sherpa. They were having a sale on it. I think it was like $25, which is good for American Eagle. Love this blue color. I have too many Sherpas at this point, but I honestly think it's fine. And it has like that big pocket at the bottom, which I like. And it's like oversized, which I also like. And it's just literally so plushy and big and warm and soft. And I love it. On TikTok, they talk about like how Walmart actually has good clothes. And honestly, they do. Like go in there and see what's up. Because my mom went and got this like crew neck thing. And then had me go back and look and see if I wanted one. And I got this. It's from the brand No Boundaries. And it was like $17, which is kind of a lot for Walmart. But honestly, I really do love this. So I got a medium, and I think that it's like unisex, so this is like men's sizes. And it's very oversized, which I love. And I love the color of it. It's like this camel color, and it's just like, it's a long sleeve shirt, but it's a little thicker than that. But not thick enough to necessarily call it like a crew neck. It's like an in-between, which is good because I don't get like too hot or too cold in it. And yeah, not much more to say about it. I just like it. It's plain and simple. So I got that. And then I have a couple things that I got at TJ Maxx. This is from Ed Hardy for like eight bucks or something. It's just like this like graphic tee. And I kind of like the vibe of it. I feel like it's different than the kind of stuff I normally wear. So I'm excited to like style this and see what I can like come up with. And then today I got this on sale. I'm a bargain shopper. Let me tell you. It's from the brand avalanche and it's an outdoor supply company and it sounded pretty like legit if you ask me i got it in a size large so it's pretty big and it was on clearance for 12 dollars, which is super good it's like a sherpa but like more of like a matted sherpa material like not as like big and poofy and fluffy and i liked the red color it does have pockets down here at the bottom and then this is Adidas and it was also on clearance and I also got it in a large because I'm having a phase with oversized things and it was on sale for $15. This is like a golf top. Uh, I don't golf, but it's still cute. So it has like the three quarter zip thing going on 
and then the stripe on the side only goes to like mid arm and then it goes to like the regular black so I thought that that was cute instead of having the stripes go down your whole arm feel like it's kind of different. That is going to be everything for this haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let me know by giving it a big thumbs up and click that little red subscribe button down below so you get notified every time that I upload a new video. A little disclaimer, I did not film this video to brag in any way. I just think that these videos are really interesting and I'm kind of like your little like shopping guide and I'm like helping you guys find new clothes and you can like Instead of just scrolling through a website, I can like tell you how I feel about like a specific clothing item and if you like it, then you can click the link below and go buy it yourself. So it's just like a little bit of a more of a more like secure review and like a review that you can trust because you never know when someone just like types out a comment like if that's actually what's going on. And I just think these videos are really fun to watch personally, so I feel like you guys will like it too. So that was kind of my intention with it, and I just wanted to do a little disclaimer real quick. That is going to be everything. I hope you guys have an absolutely amazing day, and I will hope to see you soon again on my channel. Bye!